Hello everybody, it's Michelle here with Angel Souls. This is our daily inspiration message. If you would like a personal reading, just go to my website at angelsouls444.com and check out the description box. I have lots of lives coming up, including one where we're gonna be channeling angelic messages, another one about the significance of 1010, October 10th, and another one on November 11th, 1111. So check it out. All right, our card for today is breathe. So when this card comes out, this could be one of those things where there, there could be something catastrophic going on. Um, as of the recording of this video, I believe uh, Hurricane Ian uh, is supposed to be making landfalls, I think. I don't know. Again, there's it's still kind of up in the air as of the recording of this, so I don't know what's going to be happening. But this could definitely be something major happening in the world that makes us hold our breath, that makes, makes us tense up, you know, and they say, okay, breathe it out, breathe it out. Panicking is not the answer. As a matter of fact, if you watched my other video where I talk all about um, being on the ascension path and doing like the real spiritual work, not just getting your little energetic hits here and there, that's, that's not helping you out at all. You're not helping out the collective and you're not being fair to the readers. Now, even the readers don't realize they're just freely throwing their energy around being like, here, I'll do a card reading for you, whatever. If people are not coming in and giving an equal exchange of energy, then they're being depleted. And there are some practitioners out there that you don't want depleted, okay? Because they're the ones bringing through the answers for you. They're the ones who are connected in touch. They're going to be helping through all the chaos that's coming up. So do the work do the work, make it worthwhile. So this is Archangel Raphael. Take several deep breaths and exhale slowly to awaken your energy and to release old patterns. The old patterns may be what kind of treatment would we accept? Or do we play victim all the time instead of healing ourselves? Do we fight others? In... in when I say fight one another, I'm not talking about people setting boundaries. You know, I 100% believe in that. But you can do so respectfully. Not just trying to win out over one another. Okay? So we're going to leave it there. I'm sending you all so much love and take care.